All right, so I was just making some sweet potato chips and I noticed this, which is off my last uh, Northern Star and I lost all of these over winter. Uh, so I'm going to try and grow a couple of these out and replant them. Alright, these sweet potatoes are starting to look good. I'm just going to pick um, the stems off and put them out in the sun for a day or so before I plant them. Alright, so I'm just going to pull these away from the potato. Put them in a little jar of water so they don't dry out in the sun. You just want to try and get a few of those roots. Now, these are only small, these ones usually they're a bit bigger, but they should grow just as well. Yeah. I'll take this one even though it doesn't have any roots coming out of it yet it should be all right oops bigger jar just make sure that you get the roots in the water or the stems in the water all right and i'll go and put that out uh, just in sunny spot outside so i'm just going to leave it up here it's not in direct sunlight but i'll plant those out tomorrow and they should be right anyway so you could plant them into the ground right now i suppose but i'm just going to wait find a good spot for them right, so another good way of getting sweet potato plants is just to take cuttings so you want to take about three or four of those So once you've taken off most of the leaves, just put it in a jar of water for a few days until the roots develop. Uh, but you could technically probably plant that out. You should probably use clean water. All right, so I'm just gonna be planting them up here. I've just sort of cleared this spot where a few potatoes were and spread the mulch out. And um, yeah, I'll do this. I'm just gonna see how many I've got. Two, three, four, five. So literally the easiest thing in the world to plant. Oops. So I'm going to do is just poke a hole in the ground like that, and then as I pull it out, poke that sweet potato down in there. Say that. <laughs> Oops. Just poke the hole in the ground just deep enough for it to go in as far as it can, with just the leaves poking up out of the surface. And that's it. I could probably add a bit of uh, manure and compost and stuff to this spot as well. It might help. But uh, yeah, that's pretty much all there is to it. And give it four or five months and then we'll be back harvesting them. All right, so that's pretty much all there is to it. Um, there is a space here where I'll plant that cutting that I just took in a couple of days. Uh, but I'm just gonna sprinkle around some of this organic fertilizer and uh, water it in. And we'll come back to those in a few months and see how they're doing. All right.
thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.